Hi, I'm Richard Gross, Professor of Chemical and Biological Sciences here at Polytech. The basic problems we are addressing in our research is to look at the chemical industry and say, where is there an opportunity for biocatalysis to fit in? Where is it that a chemical process is falling short and where can biocatalysis really make a difference? Uh, we've also had quite a lot of success in using biocatalysis to take fatty acids and transform them to building blocks that then can be converted to high molecular polyethylene-like materials and then can be converted to biodiesel. Well, the next step for us was, okay, how do we innovate on this? What do we, how do we take this and move this to something that's really useful? So we thought about, well, you know, in making polyol, polyesters, these are precursors to polyurethanes. So now we've started to explore how can we use these and incorporate these in new materials that can be used in a whole range of polyurethane-based products. One of the things we're looking to do next is can we take an enzyme and create a totally new catalyst from it? Can we, can we bind metals to it and have it have new activities that enzymes never had before? We're starting a company called Synthesyme, and this is our way of moving what we've learned to the marketplace. We have uh, polyol-based materials that we're beginning to develop into polyurethanes and surfactants now that we're ready to move into biopesticides. By moving from traditional chemistry to nature's chemistry and natural catalysts, we're creating a safer environment and a better future. I'm Professor Rich Gross, and that's the power of my I-squared-E.